years ago. You started an affair with Rick five years ago. No, 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 no. Don't even act like you ending it three years in and then only re after you think I died in the coma. Change anything. You still lied to me about that. Don't twist it. You fucking... Why? Five years ago? Carl was nine. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I, I still love you. No, fuck off, you whore. Rick was right. He, he never manipulated you. You jumped in. You're a bitch and a worthless piece of shit. And I never should have met you. Now get the fuck out of here. Find somewhere else to sleep. Now! Fuck you, Rick. Rick. Where is he going? Is he on the gun? He's walking towards Shane. No, 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 no. Rick. 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 Stop right there. Uh, well, well, well. Look who it is. What do you think you're doing? Putting an end to this piece of shit. No, I won't let you. Look at him. He's crazy. It's Shane. He's our friend. We have to save him. He killed the two people he was with out of paranoia that them and the governor, whoever the hell that is, would betray them. He, he's too far gone. He's not sane. That guy that shot Carl, Joseph, he deserved to get shot. We can both agree on that. The midget, I don't know, but yeah, they deserved it. But still, the fact that he turned on them just like that, for plain paranoia. I think when the walkers invaded, he had to, almost died, I think. Had to kill every single one of them to escape. I think they just, the shock made him crazy. Paranoid. And the paranoia just made him think all oh, this shit. I can tell he's starting to see it. Maybe he's starting to realize that he's paranoid and that. Alright, we can't take any chances. Well, what if you were in that situation, huh? Then I expect you. Be smart and put a bullet in my head. I'm not gonna let you touch him. You hear me? If you wanna get to the chain, you're gonna have to go through me. And I know you're looking for an excuse. No, I'm not like that. Well, that's what's gonna have to be if you wanna kill him. How about? 
we cast a vote. Everyone in the farm votes, yes or no, to keep him alive. Does that sound good? Yeah, that sounds good. Although you have to promise that if everyone does vote, that if most people vote yes, that you won't even think about killing Shane. Oh, I'll definitely think about killing Shane, but I won't do it. All right then, it's a deal. All right, let's go, start the vote. Everyone, we are here today to do a vote, democracy. As me and Rick are both the leaders of this group, we came to a disagreement about one thing, if we should keep Shane alive or not. And we thought we should do a vote. This would be the first democracy vote. It might not be the last, who knows? If things go well, we might do votes like this again. But we need to vote. Do you guys think we should keep Shane alive or kill him? Look, I know he's crazy, but he's perfectly, he's, there's no way he can get out. And it's not his fault he's like that. He, the shock and all that. And come on, we're not, if we kill him, we would just prove that we're no better than him. No better than the people he's with. No better than this so-called governor. No better than any of them. But if he gets out, he, he'll kill us all. Think on that, people. Think on that. Herschel, what do you vote? I say we keep him alive, and that's my vote. I trust his John's judgment a little bit more than Rick's, so... And I'm not trying to see anybody hurt by this decision, so that's the best thing I could have chose. If he comes to be a problem, we can always recast the vote. Michonne, do you vote kill or spare? I vote kill. He's a creepy weirdo and his breath smells like shit. On a side note, he's also dangerous. Glenn, do you vote kill? Yes? All right then. Ugh, of course Glenn vote kill. He's too incompetent to even know what's going on. He has the IQ of a turtle. I wouldn't be surprised if he wasn't even paying attention and if it's if you should kill a cockroach in the bathroom. Hell, a cockroach is worth more than you, Glenn. Get the hell out of here. I'm surprised your vote even counts. Two votes to kill, one vote to spare. It's not looking good for Shane, John. On second, though, I change my mind. I vote spare. Wh what? Why? Because of what my father said. Also, John is cute, and you are not. Oh, great. Well then, two spare, one kill. Whatever. We still have an two more votes. Come on, Lori. Make the right choice here. Do you choose to kill? Haha, <laughs> yes. Uh, of course she chose your option over mine. I mean, she already chose your dick over mine, so it makes perfect sense. <sighs> Just one more vote left. Come on, Carl. Make the right choice here. <sighs> Come on, Carl. Please. It's Shane. You, you know him. Don't listen to this fucking moron. He hasn't been your father in the beginning of the apocalypse. I pretty much have been. Listen to me. I've been the one who kept you safe. Remember the one time John got to watch over you without me? You got shot by that prick. Remember? Hell, Shane sent him to shoot you. No, shoot John, but he got you shot in the process. Don't think he wouldn't do something like that again. Make the right choice, Carl. Please. For me. I... I do think he is a threat, Dad. No. No. I think... But there's hope. I vote spare. 
Yes. You fucking... I mean, it's your vote. I respect it. I'm still a better father. Shut the fuck up. I... I'm sorry, Rick, but that's my vote. <laughs> yes. He's, he's, Shane's gonna survive. Shane's gonna make it. Uh, <laughs> I, well, a deal's a deal. I'll keep him alive. But if anything happens, it's on you. Well, it has been a month since the votes happened. Things have been going good relatively. Life has been normal. I haven't really seen any zombies in a little bit. Carl, when he found out about everything, he sided with me. And he's been living with me. I don't know where the hell Lori's been living, but quite frankly, I, I'm not going to lie. I, I do miss her, and I do still love her, and I... No, she feels the same way. I mean, she's still been avoiding Rick and doing all that, but I don't know. I don't know if I could ever forgive her. We haven't talked since then. We, since that last argument, we haven't said a word to each other. I don't know if that will ever change. I want it to, but I don't know. I didn't mean the shit I said. Maybe I did. I don't know. Wish things could go back to the way they were. When I was a sheriff, I was a police officer with Rick and Shane and with three buddies. We were unstoppable. I had a wife and kids. Kid. Yeah. But things can't go back now. I just have to accept that. I think Shane's been getting better. He hasn't been spewing any nonsense about me trying to kill him. And he does talk to me every once in a while. I don't know. There's hope. There's hope. Can I have to talk to her, right? Maybe Herschel can give me some advice, I don't know. Mm -hmm. All right, what do I gotta do today? Um, fridge is looking pretty low. I'm gonna have to tend the fields today, but oh, my back. Hey, Herschel, I... Oh. Hey, John. I need some advice All right. about Lori. All right, what happened this time? Nothing. We haven't talked since that argument I was talking, I told you about, and I just, I know I miss her, and I want to talk to her, and I regret it. I know she feels the same way. She hasn't even, she's avoided Rick, done all that, and I can just see her watch me all the time. And I don't know what to do. I want to say something to her, but at the same time, I don't. I don't know if I could ever forgive her, but I want to because I still love her. And look, I know she still loves me. Again. Look, John, I'm going to give you the best advice I could ever give you. Part ways with her. Don't go and try going back to her. That's only going to make you seem desperate for it. Or just, you could be friends with her. Just don't try getting back into major commitments. She cheated on you. She knew what she was doing. She knew it. And when you quote unquote died after what, four weeks, she went and started dating somebody else again. She's not good for you. You're right. But. So I just stopped talking to her though? Be friends with her? Yes, if you want, but don't try. Don't let her try to guilt trip you or anything, gaslight you, 
anything. Just whenever she tries bringing something up, just walk away. Don't let her try manipulating you. She's just going to hurt you again. Okay. Thank you, Herschel. No problem, but oh. Hey, Dad. Uh, hey, Cole. What? When are you gonna let Shane out of the cage? I... When I know he's safe. I... I promise you he's been getting better. I... He is better. Can't you see? He's been... Perfect. He's been fine. He... He's been crying. He's been stuck in that cage with just... Sides and food and, like, expired oatmeal. Come on, that's inhuman. This is what I thought you would have done if I knew you would spare you spare him. Look, I've been doing everything to keep us safe. I I've been doing what Rick wanted. Keep him like that, keep him safe, but keep him alive and let him know. Like he's been getting better. You know he has, and eventually I'll be able to let him out. Just not right now, okay? He's still fucked in the head. Okay, just not right now, please. Call, call. Hey, Shane. Oh, hey, hey there. How's it going? It's going good. What, what do you need here? What are you doing here, John? Oh, I, I was just checking up on you, seeing how you were doing. I can tell you're doing good. Good to see you, Shane. It is. Alright. Well, I'm gonna go now. Alright. See you. Oh. And don't let, let don't let Rick cause any trouble. <laughs> yeah. I can't just leave Shane in there. It's inhumane. He's fine now. He's sane. I, I, I can't. I have to. Shane. Shane, it's me. Oh. I... You know what? Should I do it? I... Yeah. I should. I'm gonna let you out. I'm gonna get you out. I'm gonna get you out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get this knife. I'm gonna use it. Yeah. Come on. Yes, yes. Yes. You're, you're free. Yeah, now go. Oh, ah! Oh, no, the knife! The knife! No, no, no. Oh, don't hurt me, please. Don't hurt me. Yeah, yeah. Uh, don't hurt me. Yeah. What the? Mother! Uh, uh. Am I supposed to run? Do you want me to run? But what about you? Okay, I'm running, I'm running. Dad! Rick! Louis! 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 No! What the fuck did you do?